Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. This is a video lecture for ESE 563 Digital Signal Processing. The first topic is concepts. In this topic, there are three learning outcomes. At the end of this topic, the students should be able to define continuous time and discrete time signals. Demonstrate understanding on sampling and quantization concepts. And the third one is to manipulate and sketch discrete time signals. All slides used in this video lecture are based on the monograph by Associate Professor Dr. Hazli Hashim. Signals can be further classified into few different categories depending on the characteristic of the time variable or independent variable and the values they take. Continuous time signal or analog signals are defined for every value of time and they take on values in the continuous interval, for example, between interval A and B, where A can be negative infinity and B can be positive infinity. Mathematically, these signals can be described by functions of a continuous variable, for example, the speech waveform. In this figure, the x axis is denoted as time t.